Hey, we're here. We're live, pal. Check it out. Um, it's a very special kind of stream tonight. It's a kind of magic. Um, I was, I've always been a big Ninja Turtles fan. And we were always poor. Um, so we didn't get a ton, a ton of toys. Um, surprisingly, um, for all the other stuff my mother did, she did try to keep us having toys. So we did get some. That seemed like so many at the time, but it was, it was a few. And like, there was, there, I'd never gotten a full set of anything. I never got like all four, um, road ready turtles or, uh, I never, I never got a splinter at all. The only splinter I've ever had was a 2003 splinter, which was a great figure, though the tail broke off and then it got left behind in a storage unit, which I'm certain has been sold off now. Ah. Uh. <laughs> But I'm here with my wife, Stranger. Hello. And we have a full set of Ninja Turtles to do. Let me see if we've got anyone watching. We do. We got some turtles. Cool. So welcome. Hello, everyone. This is, uh, is going to be a lot of fun, I think. So I'm going to switch over to here. Oh, okay, should I turn on the... Um, um, oh, my God. Got all the the buttons for it. Okay. Go, camera comes on, there we go. All right, now, now if we can adjust the, the light. Okay. It's on the cable, so it's gonna be over there, uh, it's gonna be a blue glow cable? to it. Yes, I see the blue glow. All right, hit the power button. Um, that should bring up white light. Alcohol, alcohol, and Now alcohol. lower it a couple of notches because that is really washed out. Okay. Also, you seem to have unplugged the monitor. Yeah, that. I saw that. Um, let me know where it needs to be. I, I can't tell because I'm looking at the delayed one. Right. Plugged into it? Uh, I don't know on where it's on the, on the left goes. side. It's, it's, it's on now. Okay, excellent. All right, I think this is good. Um, good, because it can't, good. it can't go any lower. <laughs> So, well, I mean, it's not too low. Yeah. You know? All right. So what do we got here? First, let's toss a quote into the chat. It can't be done any slower. Those two songs that you just heard are ones I'm trying to work into an album. Um, I love you your music so much. If you've obviously heard, well, if you've been around for a while, you've heard the first one, which is If the Planet Could Die. It was the first song, like original song I'd written in about two years. I was very happy with that, how that came out. And the second one is called The Bodies Walk Again. And that one I made while my wives' partners were here. And it is a waltz that sounds very little like a waltz. And I'm very proud of that fact. Mm -hmm. All right. So I guess let's introduce our turtles. The Let's Fab see. Four themselves. Let's see which which description. The Bionic Commandos. I've been watching. Um, I've been watching 2012. So let's go. Leonardo. He's the leader in blue. He'll do anything it takes to get his ninjas through. Uh, Donatello is a fellow who's got a way with machines. And Raphael has got the most attitude on the team. Michelangelo, he's one of a kind, and you know just where to find him when it's party time. There should be another couplet in there, I think. Well, yeah, Master Splinter taught him every single thing they need. Okay. That would be one lean, mean, green, incredible team. Thank you so much for doing that, because <laughs> having it, like, sort of dangling there, the, <laughs> the unbalance of it was going to really bug me. Mm -hmm. As far as I know, there was never a Mutate and Splinter, and there's certainly not a remake of them if there was. But these were, they were able to produce these originally because they're very similar molds. Mm -hmm. They all use the exact same body with different colors of plastic. But, uh, yeah. I Much like the turtles themselves. Mm hmm When I was young, and this is very important to, to learn, when I was young, um, I had Mutate and Raphael, 
which um, my bio brother really loved Raphael and wanted Raphael everything. He saw Raph he saw himself in Raphael. A lot of people like the one they see themselves in, but I didn't have a Raphael except for the spinning one with that horrifying grin. So I wanted a Raphael. So I told him that I wanted the Michelangelo, and he did the expected thing. Why is that? Oh, that's the stream preview that's blurry, not the camera. Yeah. And I, so I told him I wanted Michelangelo, and he did the thing that he always did. If he knew I wanted a specific toy, uh, he would tell our mother uh, to, that he wanted that toy just to deprive me of it. And I'd caught on to it by this point. So I told him I wanted Michelangelo. He said he wanted Michelangelo, and so I got to get the Raphael. Mm -hmm. That's also how I got one of my favorite Lego kits, which is mixed in over over there. Y'all can't see it right now. Yeah. But it's mixed in over there with all the Lego, uh, the Deep Freeze Defender. I had told him that I wanted the, the base, the snow base for the, uh, for the Ice Planet characters. So I got the Deep Freeze Defender like I wanted. And this was, this was a continuous theme throughout my childhood. Mm. This is one of the very mild frustrations, mind. So, yeah, I guess let's start out with Raphael. I don't know if these contain the pamphlets, but the pamphlets are important to me in a lot of ways. Um, I've made this, this joke for basically my entire life since I got this figure the first time. Um... That at, at one of his growth stages, it says, thinks Peach Moss is funny. And then a couple of growth stages later, it says, no longer thinks Peach Moss is funny. And that has always stuck with me. Yeah. <laughs> He's wrong is the thing. Mm -hmm. Peach Moss is hilarious. Peach Moss is hilarious. Right. So it says, go ahead and take a peek. So we got this. That's pretty fucking cool, right? A little lower. A little lower? All right. Hey, up there. All right, cool. That's pretty fucking cool, right? Uh-huh. So we're going to see what all it includes, and I really hope it has the original pamphlets. All right, fuck, I should have grabbed a knife or something. Uh, would you like me to go grab one? Um, yeah. Would you I prefer knife anything. or scissors? Either one. Whatever's easier. Okay. Yeah, like, these actually mean quite a lot to me for a few reasons, and I was really shocked. We found, um... I believe it was Raphael and Leonardo Target for very cheap. I was like, I need to treat myself with everything that's been going on. So uh, we got our mutate and raft here. And I managed to track down Donatello and Leonardo. Or Donatello and Michelangelo? Yeah. Track down Donatello and Michelangelo. Managed to get those for not not total scalper prices. A knife? No, thank you. Mm. Wait, I mean, yes, thank you. All right, here we go. And, uh, gently, gently. Keep the tape. Really that keep is... these boxes intact. Her, this it's is sturdy tape. Uh huh. That's wild. Come on. Eat this shit. There we go. There we go. All right. Now we're going to pull this out. There's a pamphlet. Uh, There's a pamphlet in here. I'm very excited for you. Oh, please, please, please have all the original print. Okay. Well, it's got the instructions on it. That's a start. Oh. No, that doesn't appear to be anything on the back either. Oh, it's just instruction. Mm -hmm. That's disappointing. That's Why wouldn't they include that? That seems like a detail that they would want to keep. Darn. Someone put in work for those. Uh-huh. All right. Well, at least we know that Raphael no longer thinks Pete Moss is fun. Mm -hmm. All right, so we're going to see about... Taking out these. Why is this tied with hemp string? Huh. That's weird. I guess it's better than plastic. Oh, probably. 
It's uh, biodegradable. Yeah, that makes sense. All right. It's also probably hella cheap because hemp's hella cheap. Uh huh. That's right. Industrial grade hemp. I make rule. <laughs> oh, Julian, you're the worst. It literally actually just the whole entire word. Mm -hmm. Um, I could get those snips if you would like. I have some fingernail clippers that are going. Okay. This is taking a while to do. I may just do that. <laughs> I don't need to keep the hemp rope in place. No, you're not going to rewire these to the boxes, I shouldn't think. Nah, very unlikely. They're going to go on display next year. Animal Crossing Amiibos, Analysis Collection of Barbers. Mm hmm Yeah, let's just use the fucking clippers. Here we go. Nail clippers. Ta 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 Dun-dun-dun-dun-dun. Dun, 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 dun. There we go. And then they do have fucking twist, twisty eye things at the bottom. So that that idea that it was because it's biodegradable is out the fucking window. Oh, well. Maybe they just used hemp rope because it's green and it would blend into the, to the <laughs> figure better. It's not even like naturally green. They dyed it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Right, but you can't dye plastics. Everyone knows that plastics don't come in different colors. That's true. <laughs> that's that's how you know people from plastoids. Oh god, what are the Doctor Who plastic mans called? Um oh I have no way of knowing that information. Oh. I'm certain that they give them a name in the episode, Autons. so Autons, sure. There we go. Here we got Raphael. He's uh Looking at the paint job here. Like the plastic's good, the molding's good. There's mm -hmm. a lot of mold lines. I guess that's how you can tell it's one of the, the budget picks. This feels smaller than the original, mm -hmm. but obviously I am larger, so that may be <laughs> that may just be that. Nostalgia is a hell of a drug. They didn't color his wristbands? How did I not notice that? They didn't color his wristbands. Huh. All right, the sides are that familiar rubbery plastic, so we've got to be very careful with those. I wonder if someone thought that they were going to be, like, part of the, like, articulation and... Possible. Didn't think it was worth the effort. Mm -hmm. I think the original had knees that bent, too, but I could be wrong there. Um, could you move it a little closer to center? Right. Always forget. We're going to mutate him into a baby. If this all works the same as I remember. So for your um, visual edification, the knife is just a little bit to the left of center of frame. Okay. And so what's supposed to happen here is you pop the heads up this way mm -hmm. and then twist them around, but I cannot get it far enough up to twist. Would you like to look at the directions? No, no, I got it. Mm -hmm. That is really, that is not as good a mechanism as the original. Plastic is definitely softer uh -huh. on the rubbery parts. And we gotta twist the legs back inside the body. As well as the arms. I forgot about the arms. Yeah, the big, the little flappy turtle feet with the big muscly arms. <laughs> um, Quite a sight. Yeah. Those there. Right, I remember. I remember the legs don't go inside. Big muscly legs go outside. Hi, Sage. Hey, Sage. We saw a movie about those recently. Mm -hmm. Was it Mutant Mayhem? That looks so good, but I haven't gotten around to it yet. On uh, Paramount Plus. They also just got the streaming rights back to Ninja Turtles 87. Because Lionsgate has been holding on to that for years while refusing to release it. 
I don't understand why Entity is that avowedly exists just to make money are so allergic to making motherfucking money. Right? Like, that's gonna get people, certain people, to show up to your doorstep. Uh huh. Ninja Turtles was the biggest brand in the world until Pokemon outdid it. Yeah. I cannot. Grab I think there was a a brief period in the middle there where Power Rangers was supreme. Yes. That was sort of it, the handoff. It never quite reached the level of Ninja Turtles. No. But it was it Power was Rangers. Bigger. The first few seasons, at least, was massive. Oh yeah. All right. So how does it want the hands positioned? Looks like it wants them full arms back into shell, keeping the elbows pushed in. Close the shell and snap it back into place. Really, really? Oh, what? Gaston? Gaston, you're in trouble. I... Gaston! We heard something outside. Dogs. Uh. Hey, Jess. Hello. There are so many tacos in the oven. There we go. All right, I got it now. One of the legs was still folded inside. Hey. So this is just basically how they all look when transformed, and it's a, a cute tur- design. That's a turtle. So if you look at it too closely and notice that um, their front legs come from the back, it gets a little weird. Yeah. They're really cute. So let's look at the rest of the stuff in the package. Got the accessories, even if it doesn't have the the pamphlet. I am honestly a little surprised it doesn't have the pamphlet. It seems like something that you would keep around. Um, something you know for something that's off. a reproduction of a classic toy, where that's the that's a lot of the selling points. Uh huh. Right. Everyone loved the little pamphlets, playmates included. So these are like. These are, oh, what is the word I want? Budget? N- no, these are appetizing to small children of this generation as well. Mm-hmm. Like, even if they're not familiar with this particular uh, branding of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, you still get it. They're teenagers who are mutant ninja turtles. That's mm-hmm. cool. All right, so the first thing I'm noticing that's different about the accessories, most of this is spot on. Mm-hmm. You've got the size that transform into forks. I believe this doesn't meet the standard level of quality of TMNT merchandise. It's definitely a budget release. Hi, Orchid. Hi, Orchid. So we got a pizza here, and it mutates into a throwing star that's still a pizza. Oh, like Yuffie. Mm-hmm. Yuffie the pizza. Mm-hmm. All right, and then we... Look at, um, they come with a container of retro mutagen ooze, which that is the, uh, the thing that can unmutate people in the 87 universe, as opposed to mutagen ooze, which mutates people. Oh, this tape is on real strong. There's a knife right there. Mm-hmm. I don't peel it. Ah. I know it's a knife. Oh, that's why I couldn't get it. It was all the way to the edge. Mm. Hard to see. So, um, as I'm saying, they all came with a canister of retro mutagen news, which I always thought was really cool. Right, that explains why they can transform back and forth, is that they both have both of the... The oozes. No, they just got the retro mutagen. Oh. This may actually be mutagen and not retro mutagen. It says retro mutagen ooze on here, though, but it shows them transforming forward. Do they mean retro mutagen ooze in that it doesn't look like the current mutagen ooze? <laughs> Maybe so. It, but this it was is 87 ma- mutagen ooze. That's true. We can, we, can, we can go with that. Did I ever introduce myself? Hey, no worries. Um, I did. believe you have before, Sage. All right, here we go. So we got oh. the mutagen ooze, the retro mutagen ooze, apparently. And it's made of this really cool yellowy green plastic. So it kind of looks like there could, there could be liquid in there. 
And then also there's this pan, which is a disappointment to me. Because in the original, it had a sticker on it that said it was turtle food as a can label. Here it's just the can and no sticker. Oh, that sucks. Yeah, that's really strange. <laughs> Don't want to lose it, though. All right, let's... um. Oh, oh yeah, and I got to demonstrate the transforming weapons, too. So we've got Raphael's size here. That's, this one's already um, mutated. And we got a pizza fork, I guess. For, eat, for eating pizza with a fork. Um, so we're not up on modern high society. Are you meant to eat pizza with a devil's fork? I think so. Okay. I, think, I think that's what they do in Beverly Hills. Okay. They get a two-pronged fork and um, summon a devil, and then they eat their pizza. And that's the only way they're allowed to eat pizza in Beverly Hills. Is in the company of devils? Yep. Damn, I should go rent myself out to pizza people in Beverly Hills. Right, I heard it pays well. Damn, I would make so much money, and then I could just not be in Beverly Hills after that. <laughs> Beverly Hills, that's yeah. where I want to be. No, I'm probably fine. I also don't want to be there. All right, so, moving Raphael here. And next, I suppose... Uh, would you like me to... Collect the trash as we go along. Um, the tape and stuff? Yes. Yeah. Please do. Okay. Stuck to my leg. Thank you. Let me go get a small bag to take care of this. Okay. There's a prime mailer under you. Oh, that's wonderful. I know you're disabled when you have, uh, Two to six Amazon packages coming at any given time. All right, here we go. We got Leonardo, the leader in blue. I'm a little disappointed. Why did that went. go so easy? Yeah. Yeah, I literally just fucking tapped it. So I'm a little disappointed that they're not choosing to continue Rise of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Mm -hmm. it, it really got slept on, and I think the art style scared people off because it looks like Teen Titans Go. And we all know how the average person feels about Teen Titans Go, and that they don't like it. Um, when, we're, when you're targeting a teenage to adult audience, that's maybe not the best style. But it really does work. Uh, it doesn't feel like Teen Titans Go. There's definitely goofy episodes. But every single one is made to build character instead of forget character. Sure. And I don't hate Teen Titans. Yet. In the way that, say, again, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles would. Mm -hmm. Where they have filler episodes, but the filler episodes are about, like, learning about the characters and how they interact with each other versus progressing the nominal story. Exactly. Leader could be in pink. That's true. No, nope, too much pink energy is dangerous. <laughs> Fuck. I know, right? <laughs> Oh my god. Power Rangers. I resented Power Rangers for a long time because I always felt like it had replaced Ninja Turtles. Uh -huh. But it's really grown on me the last few years. Mm. We were the same way with Squidbillies for a very long time. Mm -hmm. The Adult Swim show Squidbillies. Because mm -hmm. our precious 12-ounce mouths, a show that we don't recommend people watch anymore. Um, but we still love for reasons. Mm -hmm. Uh... Got a few of those. It got cancelled, like, right in the middle of its thing. They didn't even really get a final episode. Mm -hmm. Then they did one webisode that, like, no one cared about. Mm -hmm. And then they put Squidbillies on the air instead. Squidbillies is actually a really good show. Is it? Yeah. It's about more than it looks like. Ah. Uh -huh. Like, it's, it's, yes, these two redneck squids beating the shit out of each other. Uh-huh. But it's doing that as a larger metaphor for, like, how people in rural areas are fucked over constantly. Uh-huh. And convinced to fuck each other over. Yeah, there's a great episode where Ball Mart comes to town and opens a location. Oh, no. Yeah. All right. All right. So here's Leonardo. I've never wanted to drink the mutagen just because, you know, 
Now, what's cool is I like that the turtles all have different skin skin colors mm -hmm. um, in the Playmates series. This isn't really followed up on many places. Although in um, Turtles in Time, you could choose between, I think, comic and anime. And uh, anime made them all the same color. But comic gave them the uh, skin tones from the toys. It's a weird way to call it. You okay? Yeah, just trying to uh, fix something. Hmm. I'm going to go to the BRB real quick. We'll be right back in a couple of minutes. Don't go anywhere.
All right, we're back. You're back, you're front. And how? What is that from, by the way? Uh, 12 ounce. Ah, uh, okay. Hey, you're back. You're back, you're front. <laughs> Did you, uh, talk to the eye? No. Did he see you? Get it? No. <laughs> A lot of good quips. There are things I really fucking like about 12 ounce mouse still, but my god. Here we see Leonardo's Sidus cave in. They also haven't painted his um, wristbands. It shows them painted on the box, is the interesting thing. It sure does. Right down here, let's see if I can get that close and in focus. Yeah, that looks pretty good. Mm -hmm. Trying to. Here, I should be using the screen that's actually accurate. There we go. Yeah, it shows the wristbands painted. So it's weird that that would be, like, left undone. Mm -hmm. So I guess we're just going to transform all of them into babies. Uh huh. While you do that, would you like me to remove these things? Oh, that would be wonderful. Thank oh. you. All right. Well, Leonardo's uh, head mechanism is in much better shape. Very carefully peel this out. There we go. And um, here's uh, here's your nightmares for the next few weeks. Welcome to your church. Welcome to my nightmare. So notably, mm -hmm. most of these things are separate. Careful. Yep, sorry. The, um, these three things are the same. The, uh, the yeah. pizza and the mutagenic ooze and the can, yeah. which still the, doesn't have the turtle food label on it, so it's just a mystery can for no reason. Ah. Uh, but let's look at the, uh... All right, Orchid, see you later. Thanks for coming. Get some sleep. Have a good night. If he can. If he can get some sleep, get some sleep. I know how it is. Go on another one this way. And put the arms back here. Wow, they were really aggressive with this tape, huh? Uh huh. Really aggressive with the tape. Yeah, you want a knife? Mm. Thank you, but I have it. Okay. I was kind of hoping we'd uh, relive the previous scene, but in reverse. Yeah. I should have <laughs> been chivalrous and allowed that to happen, uh, uh, but I had just got. So, oh, right, I forgot you're supposed to fold these around in front. Flip them into the belt here. Because they're baby turtles, so their front shield hasn't formed fully, I guess. Mm -hmm. Oh, that does not want to go in. There we go. This one's warped because of how it was packed. I don't want to be rough with them because, in my experience with the originals, these break. Hey, beekeeper. Hello. It's a pity Alice Cooper went to Kevin Sorbo. I still have my copies of Welcome to My Nightmare and Lace and Whiskey on vinyl. Oh, that's Wild. Strange. Pretty cool stuff, though. Yeah, it's cool stuff. It's a shame Alice Cooper's like Alice that. Cooper. <laughs> yeah, it really is. Why does this turn? This didn't turn in the original. Mm -hmm. There's no reason for it. Oh my you god, could... yes, there is. I forgot about this part. Um, holy shit. So that's going to make this a lot easier to get out. Right. At least that's the hope. And yeah, but the tails are made of the same rubber as the sides. I completely forgot the tails were there. Doesn't want to turn. Does not want to turn. I'll get it. I'll get it. Gosh darn it. Turn it with the shell. There we go. All right. All right. Cool. Got to do this with Raphael in a sec too. There we go. Little little baby turtle tail. Uh, Alice Cooper on the Constrictor tour. Wow. Mm -hmm. We got to see the Rob Zombie once. Mm -hmm. He threatened to fight the crowd. 
that sounds like Bob Zombie. Yeah, it was a really bad crowd. Uh huh. Because it was an Oklahoma City crowd. Oh right? yeah, this is not a place for. Uh, this is not a place for Rob Zombie. Yeah, it was Rob Zombie and um, Ozzy Osbourne oh, wow. for the Over the Top tour. Oh wow. Yeah, yeah. We we got free tickets because we uh, scalped a bunch of uh, corporate seats. Um, ah, 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 ah. in uh, for an interested third party who will remain nameless at this time. Uh -huh. uh, you know, if you're gonna scalp stuff, make sure it's corporate shit. Yeah. I have no problem with that. Yeah, so we were just walking the streets in front of the in front of the newly built arena. Baby Leonardo. As it was at the time. Just like, hey, if you want tickets to the show, we have them, and they're $40. Mm -hmm. At a concert for $40. That was a long time ago. Yeah, I know, right? And an Ozzy Osbourne Rob Zombie concert. Uh-huh. All right, I'm going to bring Raphael back out. Um, you're going to keep putting their stuff away, but I'll keep the turtles, I'll keep the turtles out. He did, like, Astro Creep, and the crowd gave him nothing. Wow. Yeah, so he, like, just stood on the monitors, the mm -hmm. line of monitors at the front of the stage, and just tightrope walked across them while he just went into the mic. It's like, all right, so I'm out here giving my best, and uh, y'all are not doing anything. If I have to come out there and fight every single one of you, that is what I will do. <laughs> That's Rob Zombie, all right. <laughs> I like Rob Zombie. I hope he's not terrible. He did um, threaten to fight someone for saying baby metal sucked. That is true. He seems like a good guy. He's not one of the ones I've met even briefly. Mm. Uh, Marilyn Manson I met briefly. And, um, he's and Marilyn a, Manson seems like a lot. He's, he's not, is the thing. Mm. He's just a basic ass motherfucker <laughs> who tries to put on his, these air first of all he puts on the airs of being edgy on the stage but he's not an edgy guy he's a fucking math teacher uh -huh. and also he is an abuser so fuck him he comes off as a suburban piece of shit huh. that sucks uh huh literally I the did, opposite I of did. everything he uh, pushes I've never really had any particular affection for Marilyn Manson. Uh-huh. So I am I am not crestfallen by this news. Uh-huh. It does still suck. It sucks when anyone sucks. Uh-huh. It sucks doubly when anyone who can summon a microphone at any moment sucks. Mm-hmm. Look at that. We got two turtles now. Hey. Okay. Oh hell yeah. Pizza. Pizza. Alright, so now we got the swords. I didn't have Leonardo. Um, as as you know, I only had um, Raphael, and my brother had Michelangelo. So uh, the swords mutate into smaller swords, <laughs> I guess. Yeah, I was wondering about that too. I was wondering if I was missing something uh -huh. in the doing, but no, it's just smaller swords. Uh huh. I suppose in um, in conjunction <laughs> with the psi forks. These are probably knives, mm -hmm. or meant to be like table knives for food. Yeah, they don't look it though. They do not look it. All right, let me get out. I know there's. I'm still so disappointed that they didn't include the lore pamphlet. Hello, Bad Road. That is as close to crestfallen as I get around a new toy. Dos Tortugas. <laughs> hey, Bad Road. Yeah, they which have means place of the skull. Which I don't even remember this being what the original instructions looked like. So, damn fucking shame. Yeah. Uh, I remember um, you went out and found a the only scan of Raphael's pamphlet on the internet. It was this tiny low res thing. Yeah, I put it. Was I put a, I put the thing together for a video. Uh huh. Where we were drinking hot sauce and you were talking about these toys. Uh huh. I still have that footage somewhere, because I don't throw away assets. Uh-huh. All right, who's next, Donatello or Michelangelo? Before we continue, I want to say that I said Tortugas meant Place of the Skull. Did you? Yeah, while you were talking. Oh. There was, there was crosstalk, but it was a really good joke, and I wanted to, I really wanted to make sure it got out there. 
It's a, it is a good joke. Thank you. I felt accomplished when I said it. All right. So Mikey or Donnie. Another interesting thing with these. The originals say Mutate and Donatello. They use the full name. Uh-huh. Which isn't necessarily what you expect from a Playmates toy. Which I'm guessing um, is why they changed it to the nicknames on these. It's still a very odd choice to change that. I think it's... Looking at this box, mm -hmm. I'm willing to bet a pretty good amount that they changed the name so that it fit relatively well underneath the logo treatment. Oh, yeah. That could be. Yeah, because mutating Donatello would put it, like, out to here. Mm -hmm. So you'd have to move the entire logo over so that or it would center over the box. Yeah, or use a much smaller font, and then you're, like sitting on that edge of is this readable do you think this font is something that you can find on the internet oh almost certainly as it's cool all right oh I, place I, I, I thought you said face place is much better yeah all right so i guess since i've got donatello here he's who i'm doing next okay all right let's see if this tape is invincible or easy Indestructible. Another easy one. Indefensible. For some reason, the tape on Raphael's was yeah. fucking impossible to get off. Alright, here we go. Donatello, he's a fellow, got away with machines. Here we go. Look at that. Donatello looks so mad. None of the others look this pissed off. Donatello's finally standing up for himself. Uh-huh. And then gets turned into a baby for his trouble. <laughs> Which is not unlike my lived experience. What's interesting, or mine, mm. what's interesting about um, this is it's not based on the cartoon because they show them changing over time, which means they're based in either comic or movie continuity. Mm -hmm. Rather than the mutagen being unbelievably fast acting. Mm hmm. 87 and 2012 had the instantaneous ooze. What's interesting is that the ooze play is a very different, is done very differently in Rise. Um, it mutates some mosquitoes who uh, then can spread it to others by biting them. Ah, uh, but it doesn't mutate the mosquitoes themselves. Well, it mutates them into ooze carriers, but it doesn't do a lot to them. Okay. I presume that's a framing device sort of thing. Yeah. Like Miraculous Butterfly. Yes. Miraculous Ladybug? That is what I meant, okay. yes. Uh, I will remove the, the bits from that. Transform. Oh, thank you very much. This? Uh, Neil, I think I have it. Thank you. Okay. So here's Donatello, the angriest turtle, as everyone knows. No one is it. I may actually paint these. This is really bugging me. I just gotta find a good paint for them. But that'll drop their collector's value. Fuck off. No one in here is like that. <laughs> Alright, so let's let's transform angry Donatello. If the if folks were being like that, they would already be upset with the way that we are treating. Oh, yeah. The extraneous materials of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Yep. Uh, you take and play sets. Clipping the rubber ties. Uh huh. All right. So there we go. Once again, your nightmares. Welcome to them. I also had a swim in Donatello, the same series as the Raft with the Terrifying Smile. Uh, they, were, they were the wind up series, basically. Uh, Donatello had a little floaty thing with a harpoon he held. And then when he wound him up, he'd kick his legs. Like in the call, uh, like in the video game. They have a little floaty thing in the video game? Uh, no, but they swim by kicking their legs. Oh, I mean, that's how I swim too, to be fair. Mm -hmm. That's how a lot of people swim. Mm -hmm. It's just like real life. Mm -hmm. Ninja Turtles, just like real life. TM. Ding. Oh my god, this is this is so cool. For any amount of disappointment I have is being completely um removed in place of just serotonin. Hey, there we go. 
Now, the interesting thing about these figures, I know I say that about everything about these figures, but this one, their, sh their bodies are very wide to accommodate the transformation. And it does make them look kind of like uh, they beefed up a lot. Like they ate some pizza and lifted some weights. Hey, that was my Wednesday. <laughs> Now let's see what the transforming bow turns into. I'm guessing a smaller bow. I doubt what it's like I have one. to guess, I don't know. Like, it doesn't look like it does a thing. Uh-huh. It doesn't look like it turns into a massive spoon somehow. Uh-huh. It says pogo bows. Hmm. Of course, uh, Leonardo's also says mind-bending katanas, so I don't know. They're mind bending. How big are they? Big or little? Are they katana or wakizashi? They aren't even doing this for like alliteration. Ogo bows, mind bending katanas. Raps is the only one that says shape changing. So these are bendy. Ooh, let's see. Which I suppose they're meant to be. Um. Ah. I have no idea what I'm looking at. So here we go. Oh, there we go. Okay. He turned them. Yeah, turns into a pogo stick. Yeah, you just flip them turn ways. <laughs> that's a choice. Why are they so rubbery? Um, that's a great question. I presume so they can be flexible enough that the very small uh, turny things can very small turny. Also, don't let the church see these. Yeah, you could, speaking of the place of the skull, you could absolutely crucify someone on one of these. <laughs> wow. I know. That's, um... Hmm, maybe that's why these weren't on the shelves that long. Here's the... <laughs> oh my god. The scratches here from manufacture. I'd be afraid to try and sand down these mold lines. And the scratches here from manufacture. Yes. We've got the same unlabeled can, which... I don't know why that's the most disappointing thing to me, that it doesn't have a fucking turtle food label. It's that it's completely contextless, uh -huh. I think. Like, that, the, the mutagen doesn't have a label either, and I sort of feel like it should have one. Mm -hmm. But you can tell what it is because it's green and glowing. Right? Yeah. And that, that is actually how it came in the original. I would, I, would, the label. I, would, I would like to try an experiment. Well, actually, let's open the um, last one, and then I okay. would like to present an experiment. Okay. Uh, shit. Just graveyard out here. Oh, right. You wouldn't want the rest out to crucify anyone because that would make it too easy to breathe. <laughs> yep. All right. It would actually not surprise me if that was the reason that these were taken off the shelf that so fast. Mm hmm. All right, Michelangelo, he's one of a kind, and you know just where to find him when it's party time. You wouldn't want the footrest out to crucify yeah. someone. Oh, okay, it was Bad Road that said that. Yeah. Is it like a really good sort of scholarly joke about the about biblical things? Then probably Bad Road. <laughs> We lost or zoo. All, or zoo, but we lost the part of ourselves that knew a lot about the Bible, the Christian Bible, uh -huh. uh, quite a long time ago. Mm -hmm. We had, presumably, it's still at our mom's place, mm -hmm. uh, a medal that we got from the Southern Baptist Church Awana's program. Mm -hmm. For being their Bible quiz champion, their regional Bible quiz champion. Wow. Yeah. I just got one for math. That's probably um, more useful than knowing precisely how Bible verses go, mm -hmm. which is what a Bible quiz champ is. Mm -hmm. it's, a, it's a by rote thing. Thank you. All right, so here's Michelangelo. I like how they monogrammed his belt specifically. It's a very stylized. All of them are, but they're stylized differently, which is kind of weird. Because Leonardo, his is like kind of, I don't know, cubist. 
And then Michelangelo's is like someone took a big old fucking paintbrush and made that. Hey, Donatello's. Donatello's looks like the looks looks like he's a I don't know a Disney a Disney font. Maybe it's just because it's a D, but it kind of looks like that font. That's the double there D. Oh, okay. Or Ducktales. I think that's almost exactly Ducktales as well. Oh. It's quite like those fonts, yes. Uh huh. And finally, we got Raphael. I don't know what's up with Raphael's. It doesn't even stay in the uh, the metal that's supposed to, or the buckle that's supposed to be monogrammed. It goes right over the edge of it. Raphael don't give a fuck. Raphael just fucking draw everywhere. All right, let's see. Michelangelo. Uh, mostly the same articulation. I could have swore that the knee is bent, but I think I'm wrong. Thinking back on it, I think I'm wrong about that. Oops. Also, this Raphael skin is definitely darker than the original. It was kind of a, a nice French green. Oh, I thought Michelangelo's tail was missing for a second. Like, are you serious? Are they two with my boy's tail? Mm-hmm. Are we going Michelangelo? That out there. Uh, yeah, the rotating shell is helping a lot. Seriously, don't think the original had that, so that's an improvement. Again, it's one of those things where I might be wrong. But that's how I remember it. There we go. Yeah, like for small children, this might not be the best set of figures. It's definitely aimed at adult collectors. Mm -hmm. um, I was about to say there's nothing to uh, really choke on, fortunately, but we do have the turtle food can. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff to choke on. Yeah. But like, these, if you're playing with these a lot, this plastic, which is the same as in the originals, will break around these uh, joints. That's something I have experience with. And as an adult, I can um, help that. But as a kid, it, that shit broke. And these are not like beefed up in quality in a way that would prevent that from happening. I'm guessing that the nunchucks just turn into shorter nunchucks. Uh, I think they turn into longer nunchucks to be jump ropes, actually. It says newly formed ninja nunchucks. Oh. Yeah, the long one is the size that they would normally be. Oh. They're very long. It just... In some, of, in so, some cartoons, they extend. Like in 2012. It's pretty cool. Here is the short version. Mm hmm Here is the longer version. Actually, oh. can you enshorten yours so we can see them side by side? Yeah. Newly formed ninja nunchucks. Here we go. That's the difference. Yep. What a transformation. Mm -hmm. Raphael's is the only one that's, and I guess Donatello's is, but it's also terrifying. Mm -hmm. Donatello and Raphael got the best uh, weapon mutations. All right. Have all the bits and pieces. We'll set them aside. Our own little boxes. Thank you. Mm -hmm. And here we have it. We have let's do let's do this. We got oops. These two have skin tones very close to each other in a way they didn't used to. Mm -hmm. Um Leonardo's was was slightly lighter olive. Donatello's is about accurate. So as I was saying, Leonardo, he's a leader in blue, will do anything it takes to get his ninjas through. Donatello is the fella got away with machines. Raphael got the most attitude on the team. Michelangelo is one of a kind, and he knows just where to find him when it's party time. Master Splinter taught him every single thing they need to be one lean, mean, green, incredible team. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Heroes on a half shell. Turtle power.
you for the quote, Bad Road. All right, so we're going to... It's 9.30 already. Well, I guess let's just take the break now while I tidy this stuff up. And then we'll come back for Nobody's Home. Yeah. All right, so remember that there is a civil rights movement happening around the country and the wider world. Those are Black Americans, people of color. This is my stream deck. Black Americans, people of color are fighting for things that should never have to be fought for. Things like equal rights, equal treatment under the law, and not be attacked, terrorized, and even murdered by the police. We have listed here a few ways you can help, including the Bail Fund Network to help keep protesters out of jail, the Okra Project and the Black Trans Travel Fund to help black trans and non-binary people with food supplies and travel out of dangerous situations, and the Black Hills Legal Fund, the Lakota People's Fund to take back their land with six grandfathers, which was stolen by white people, arbitrarily renamed Mount Rushmore, and then had some white slave owners' faces carved into the side of it. Under the second command are more ways you can help. These are kept up to date by my wives. A uh, stranger here can be contacted if there is anything else that needs to go here. They are September and stranger, all one word in the chat. Black lives matter. The lives of people of color matter. Indigenous lives and lands matter. Asian and Pacific Islander lives matter. These are things we've got to keep saying and pushing and fighting for until the people all the way to the top not only understand and acknowledge them, but work to make them real protected truths. All right, we're going to go to the break right here. And we're going to tidy up, and we're going to run some ads. We have no stance on ad blockers, but we will see you back here in just a few minutes. See you soon.
welcome back. Uh, it's me, Katie, still with my wife, stranger. Hello. How y'all doing? Man, I'm going to put this, this intro window up for a second. There we go. Now it's like we're just starting. Yeah, it's like we're just starting. Mm -hmm. It's not we unboxed the uh, turtles. We unboxed a bunch of turtles. We, the VODs are going to be split, so. Yeah. <laughs> but this is if you're watching on YouTube, hello YouTube, this is the start of the Nobody's Home experience. Hey yo. All right. Or and Nobody's Home experience, I suppose. That's true. That's experiences true. are different depending on who has them. Mm -hmm. All right, let's uh let's do this. I don't know anything about this except that it's uh Oats's game that came before No Delivery. So I'm expecting it to be a little rougher than that, but also I'm expecting it to be really cool. We will 100% see how it goes. Yep. Ah, hey. I know how that works. Nobody's home. Options. Same options as ever. Always dash. Command remember. Yeah. Welcome to Volum. These are made on RPG Maker. One of the RPG Makers. I don't remember which one. Mm -hmm. Um, yeah, definitely. Ooh, yeah. That's, even if I didn't have trouble with flashing lights. That just sort of looks bad. Yeah. All right, filter off. Here we go. On blank 10th, 1970 blank, local youth broke into an, undis an undisclosed residence. Let me take that again and not stutter in. Mm -hmm. On blank 10th. 1970 blank, local youth broke into an undisclosed residence, inviting a number of guests over. What followed would be known as the greatest party ever to be thrown. There are no known survivors. <laughs> that's a good, that's Love a it. good line right there. Love it. Fucking beautiful. Hey, battery power in the upper left. Um, find a way out. Um, what? We're gonna. A large home camcorder aimed at the bed. The cassette slot is jammed shut. At the bed where we were passed out. Yep. So, hey, let's talk about content warnings. Mm hmm. There's gonna be a lot of dark shit here. Um, apparently, some sexual in nature. Possibly. We don't know that for sure, but we do wish to it's put forward the possibility. It's definitely the intent um, to allude to that, um, even if that's not what happened. Okay, so there's green stuff blocking this way, brown stuff blocking the cell. Here I am, stuck in the middle with you. And we save games with cigarette butts. That's cute, I like that. So this one looks like it's going to be harsher than the other two in a lot of ways. Because it looks like it's going to get into more personal stuff. As opposed to being, uh, what does Oats call it? Workplace horror? I don't remember. There was a word he used. Yeah. I got a crushed can, a party cup, and an empty bottle. The three genders. And some beer. Interesting. I guess we'll go the you way that get isn't another locked. crushed can. Oh, there is one, huh? Yeah. Sweet. Can't get an alarm clock though. It's probably flashing twelve, but the graphics are too low res. Mm -hmm. Bathroom still steamy. Someone's definitely dead in that shower. Handprints on the mirror. People fucked in here. Pink champagne on us. Beer cans. Beer cans. Beer cans. Beer cans. Beer cans. Crushed can, party cup. Why am I collecting these? I yeah. Don't why know. are we cleaning up after this? A party? cold, wet room. Beautiful. Frisbee, you need to chill. Getting overexcited. Is someone there? Uh oh, did you want to use the shower? Uh, sorry, I think I'm gonna be in here for a while. The um stuffs not washing off. Actually, can you do me a favor and pass me my clothes on the sink? 
Uh, friend, I have bad news for you. Shit, they're gone, aren't they? You mind doing me another favor? Can you find me some clothes somewhere? Anything will do. Beats wearing nothing. Alright, um, I guess we gotta step to the closet. It looks like there's two green things blocking the way, though. Ugh. Ugh. Oh, that one damaged me. Oh, my battery. Oh, that's what the damaged. battery is. Apparently, that's my disgust. Is this a forest? Oh. The trembling vestige craves nicotine. Now, that's, that's a you right there. The trembling vestige craves nicotine. Leave them alone for the moment. How many cigarette butts do I start with? Uh, None, it looks like. Yeah, you appear to have zero. Alright, well. Cleaned up the horrible green stuff. Are you meant to collect one from the ashtray? Is no, the ashtray is the save point. Oh, right. It's taking away cigarette butts. Yeah. Oh, Good. well. One HP left. Good. I'm sure there's ways to... One bar of battery oh, in a dream. Well, used to recover HP and gain an M. Oh, good. Oh, my name is Party Goer. I got a peeled label, too, which I didn't mention. Oh, it probably... Can you use beer can? You cannot. Yeah, I just did. Well, uh, no, the crushed can. I'm sorry. Oh, okay. Um, We were thinking of the... For self we were thinking of the myriad of times where we... uh. Picked up a drink that we had sat down some time ago and our father had put a cigarette out of him. Ugh, yeah, that was the same with my bio dad. Mm. It's really gross. They smoke in Narnia? Yeah, Mr. Tumnus famously, famously has a massive pipe. <laughs> Cigarettes are a bit weird, um, but, you know, there's nothing wrong with them. Notes are pasted to the wall. Occupied. Flip for vac- Okay. Stack party cups here. I don't think I have six. I have two. But there's cup stacking involved. You know what they say about cup stacking. I won't it's repeat all in it. The, it's all in the tips. Mm -hmm. Three. What they say about cup stacking is one, three, one, one, two, five, two, one, three, two. Oh, it's just September that that really bothers. I have a. Apparent affinity for uh, insensible speech oh. in a way that September does not know. Gotcha. All right, good. I can make that reference sometime. Mm -hmm. <laughs> hey, I got a cigarette butt. I guess we're going to fight a zombie. Ooh. Just a skull with sunglasses. Look at those teeth. They shamble towards you. Bottle crack. Oh, look at that. Look at that. That's interesting. To do an attack without a party favor, you have to uh, use your HP. Hmm. Not better. Not enough empty, but oh, it costs four. What the fuck? I thought that was saying how many I had. Oh, wowzers. Yeah. Holy shit. Can you ignite? Because you can't. You got one human meat. It retreats. Fuck. Hmm. Challenging. Uh huh. Uh. Also, I did not recall anyone mentioning Mr. Thomas's massive pipe. Uh, no, those aren't words I should say. I could be wrong. It's been quite a while since I've read Lion, the Witch, and the Wardrobe. I remember, but it's one of these things that, like, magical people in British fantasy have pipes. Mm hmm Like, Gold King Cole. Oh, that's American. Like, I was thinking Gandalf, specifically. Mm-hmm. Gandalf canonically With smokes a lot English. of... Yeah. Okay. Alright, we can make a call or leave a message. See we can call. The number one is worn down. 
No answer. Darn. Leave a message? Last message, get more beer. Change message. Is this going to come up later? Get me out of here. I could just type. The very zombie wolf. Oh, I figured, remember Gandalf smoked. I just figured you were going for a multiple entendre. That was the thing that I decided to not say. I don't like how you fought someone in the dark and got human meat. Yeah. Uh, again, really challenging. It's okay. It's not really human meat. It was just being held by a skeleton. Sure, and the skeleton used to be human. It's meat from a human in that a human handed you some meat. Exactly. It can be used for feeding. Note that it doesn't say to eat or uh -huh. drink. It says for feeding. feeding. Uh, it trips me out when it goes blurry on the menu. So I have to ask this question. What's up? Are we in a green dress or are we wearing a towel? I think it's a towel. Okay. I don't have a way to check. That's not part of the menu. Human meat is often held by a skeleton. You know what? You're right. That was mine too. You're right. <laughs> oh. I'm, I'm sorry. Ow. Ow. <laughs> and I got a crushed can. And you got another crushed can. Here's a poster. And the tiger poster. And the tiger poster. Glad there's so much trash laying around is something I've never said before. Mm -hmm. Okay, so green always hurts us. Oh no, green takes two 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 steps Instances. to hurt us. And the brown hurts us instantly. Uh -huh. It looks like a carnivorous plant. The barbs are wrapped tightly around the shoes. Okay, sure. Feed the plant human meat to get shoes. Alright, that's a start. That that's clothes. We can take that back to have some hairs in, in some, some bad, bad places. places. That's interesting. I don't usually think of uh, shoes having tears. Like, holes weren't in them, sure, but tears? Like, you've seen... Uh, ah, someone just threw a fucking bottle at me. You've seen our, like, sets of uh, Chuck Taylors, right? Mm -hmm. We used to wear Chuck Taylors all the time, and they fell apart after, like, a year and a half. Yeah, you know why? It's because they were a really cheap, shitty shoe when I used to get them, and then they got popular with hipsters. Yeah, the, the like, all of the cool colorations and stuff is great. Mm -hmm. I got mocked for wearing those when I was a kid. Uh -huh. When they came into style... Basically, as soon as I got out of school. That's a shame. Uh-huh. What are those three drops? In the upper left? Uh, yeah. That is more window. can stacking stuff. Oh, okay. I'm curious about this at the top of the wall here. There's the, blood and then there's something like above it. Looks like stairs almost. It does look like stairs almost. Doesn't look, I bet we stack the cups. Are we supposed to be stacking the cups to try and get out the window? I don't think they'll hold. I was also wondering if we were in a dress or a towel. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's a, a towel. Ugh. Oops, why can't I go down this? Oh, because Oats had not mastered RPG Maker yet. Mm -hmm. Those, uh visual planes mm -hmm. are really something else this is all fixed by um no delivery no delivery fixed basically all the tr troubles i'm seeing here here's the room where people were smoking weeds notes are pasted to the wall refreshments tv this is i can't go around with one hp that we know uh-huh good finding more beer Another carnivorous plant. I don't have more human meat yet. Hey, hey cigarette, cigarette butt. butt. So maybe you can go get um, clothes from the closet, Dina. Oh, that's possible. We can try that. 
Yeah, I'll restore us to full health first. I don't know who I give those labels to. The trembling vestige craves nicotine. The trembling vestige craves more. Ah, oh, come on, you jerk! I kind of figured that I would need more than one. Yeah, that's usually the case with cigarettes. Mm-hmm. Bet you can't eat just one, Marlboros. Aston, no. Issue. Issue. Oh yeah, there's a dress over there too, huh? Yeah, but that's another commemorous plan. We we need a bunch more. Mm -hmm. We need to kill a whole lot more people if we're gonna get dressed. Uh-huh. Is it gonna turn out that I was actually the killer the whole time? At the ending? Oh, that'd be interesting. <laughs> oh, dropped from the ceiling. Hey. hey, it's the thing. It crawls on you. Um... Bottle crack. Bottle crack. There we go. Hey, human meat. It retreats. Oh, we didn't kill it. We just broke part of it. Was that there before on the head? Uh, yes, I believe that's the case. Okay. It looks like she's been cracked in the head with a bottle. Yeah, a little bit. Which is probably what happened. I've told that story, right? Which one? Uh, the, the story where I cracked my head. Yes. Hey, okay. I don't know if you told it on stream. Oh, uh, I was at a party. I was at a New Year's party. Mm -hmm. And a friend of mine was playing DJ. Mm -hmm. And he played Welcome Home by Coheed and Cambria, which was at the time our, our like, on-repeat banger. Uh -huh. And so there's that, that uh, uh, on the acoustic guitar intro, that boom, Mm -hmm. And then it goes into the rock guitar. So when I went into the rock guitar, we went down on one knee to headbang, pushed our head forward, pulled our head back for the first headbang. And you know that sound um, when you get a free ball in pinball? Uh-huh. That clock sound that's the, the internals of the pinball machine mm -hmm. uh, doing something? That's the sound our head made when it collided with the corner of the table. Ow. Yeah, so... At the time, we were very drunk, which is a statement you could apply to the whole of our 20s. Mm -hmm. But uh, we didn't feel a lot of pain from it. We were just like, oh, wow, what a silly, goofy-ass thing. Hey, I'm bleeding. Um, so Cash, like, took us into the bathroom and, like, washed our hair to the point where it was no longer washing red. Uh All right, I need more human meat to get the dress. Yep. Got pants and shoes. Ooh. Nasty. A lot of shit there. Can also, we... a car seems to have crashed into the door. Is there a meteor in the trunk? No, there's a person in the trunk. Hello? It... Is someone out there? Here. Here. I'm in the trunk. Now, normally... I'd say there's a good reason for this, but but there isn't. <laughs> um, can you can you see the car keys anywhere out there? No. Oh damn it! I, I don't even know how long I've been stuck in here, and they could be anywhere. Shit! How long have I been stuck in here? It's gonna turn out that they're in his breast pocket. Oh. Listen, it looks like you're my line to the outside. Got it? If you could find the keys out there and get me out of here, it'd be great. Help a brother out, would you? It's not like I'm going places. There's pizza. There is pizza. Just, Just a plain, plain old, old pizza, pizza box. box. Da -na 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 -na. Ba -na -na. Head wounds bleed way more than they ought to. Oh yeah, that's why uh, bleeding is a thing. Uh-huh. Makes you feel uneasy for some reason. Because it's the only bit of normalcy in the whole place. I, yeah, so with how filthy everything else is, I don't want to trust that this pizza has not been ah, manipulated in some way. Someone threw another fucking bottle at me. 
Who's just hucking bottles at you? Yeah, this ain't cool. I've got six cups now. Oh, good. Why did that make an eating sound? Um, you know what? Don't worry about it. <laughs> All right, I don't see any keys. So I have had mornings like this. Uh huh. Where you get up at someone else's place and you're sort of stepping around the refuse. Uh huh. Trying to sort yourself out so you can leave and go to work and pretend that you're not a mess. Uh huh. Chill. Don't open that door. Here's a lockpick. I figure you, the master of unlocking, should take it with you. Thanks, Barry. Uh, I guess we stack cups, hey? Uh-huh. Which one should we stack? Um, so... Oh, wait, there is another room there. Oh, right. Oh, wait, that's the kitchen. Yeah, that's the kitchen. So... One is directly under a window, which sort of says to us, that is that. And that one's under a noose. Let's go to the other one. Yeah. That's gonna be rough right there. Yep, let's go to the other one. I feel like this was this one's uh, going for a bit edgier than the other two. Which is what I happens when you get older. You get less edgy. I don't necessarily know if I would count it as edgy. Because edgy has this sort of pretentious quality to it, right? Mm -hmm. It's it's there like this is an insincere thing that I am doing. Mm -hmm. Uh to provoke because I'm an asshole. Because I'm 14 or whatever. Or I'm just an asshole. Sometimes people are just like that. Mm -hmm. I think that you can... That's kind of what I'm thinking about this. Is, is it's it... feeling a bit provocative for the sake of being provocative. Uh, and I may be wrong. I think that I would like to withhold judgment on that myself until we see what the larger ideas are. Mm -hmm. There's a dead body in the pool. Uh, no, that's just uh, a sexual pride beach ball. Oh, okay. No, not asexual. What is that? The silver, blue, and black? I don't know. Not familiar with it. Okay. So it clearly um, wants me to go through this side. It... There's something there and something there that I have to check. Yeah. Fortunately, we have a lot of beer. Um, seems like it's just random whether it does damage or not. Fortunately, it always does one damage. Uh, maybe they're both... Um, Is someone in the trunk or did the car not open from the inside? They're in the trunk. They said they were in the trunk. A lot of trunks that it's 1970, so, yeah, so that, the trunks don't open from the inside. Yeah, automatically. The pool seems shallow here. Buoyant objects may be stable in this spot. Oh. I don't have any buoyant objects. Right, but if we come back with a beach ball. Mm -hmm. It's a lot of going into the menu and using healing items, which is fine. They gave me plenty of healing items. You got one cigarette. <laughs> Fucking hell. And I don't plan on hitting save game at any point. I can't unstack the cups, huh? Still don't know what to do about the blood on that wall. Alright, so what do we do now? I guess we give another cigarette butt to the guy. I guess. I don't have any more human meat at the moment. Oh, Leather Pride is the one I was thinking of. Okay. That's why I don't know. Yeah. That is not a community I am a part of. Um, it's not really a community I'm a part of either, but I've seen it a bunch. Ah. Uh, the trembling vestige craves meat. Uh, not that I'm against it, it's just, you know... Well, there's a lot of work. Very expensive. Uh-huh. Oh, I can give her shoes and pants. Oh, right, we could do that. Found some clothes for me? I'm gonna need a top, obviously. Found some jeans? It'll do, but do not 
want to know who lost these. And some shoes. Awesome. I need all that so I can walk out of here. Oh, right. why didn't we wear the shoes? Right? That would have been so much easier than... It was not an option, unfortunately. Oh. It's like John McClane. I went and checked and everything. Thing to see on the bed. It doesn't look like it. Just sex stains. A lot of sex right there. Or he... blood. It's red specifically, so it's ambiguous. Yeah, I mean, we were filming it, so we probably yeah, wanted it to be impressive. Something horrible happened also, though. That, yes. That's dangerous. Oh, the bare-ass cord? Yeah. Uh-huh. What's happening there? Where? Um, at the bottom center of the screen. Oh, hey, I didn't notice that. Is I that another... That. Yeah. Fuck! Wow. God damn it. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> I started wondering aloud whether that's what the thing was going to be, and then the thing was that. <laughs> we, do, we need to look around for a phone number. We're extremely drunk and didn't think of wearing the shoes. That makes sense. Mm -hmm. Why does the abandoned house have electricity and phone service? So they never said that this house was abandoned. They just said that we broke in. And it was unspecified. Gotta be a phone number here somewhere. Oh, okay, uh, what's that? I was about to ask what that was. Hey! Hey! Great, someone's still here. Thought the place was empty by now. So, uh, I kinda, sorta, absolutely need your help here. That is, in fact, someone's butt floating in the pool. Yes. Basically, I need some clothes. Yeah, <sighs> clothes. I'm kinda not wearing anything right now. What? Hey, you don't have to look. Pretty sure you can take my word for it. Listen, if you could just do this for me. No questions asked? It's getting pretty cold out here. So, we've already made our choice to give the clothes to the person in the shower. So, I think we still have the clothes that we... Hey, I thought we'd given them to her. Uh, I think they're still in our inventory. Hey, give clothes. Just a shirt is fine. Great. Jeans. Shit. Are we going commando in these? And shoes. These should fit me just fine. Okay, so we need to get the dress. Mm -hmm. But I haven't seen a shirt. The person in the shower said a top. This person specified a shirt. Uh -huh. Which makes me think that the person in the shower is a woman. And the person in the bushes is a guy. Although... Mm -hmm. Not prescriptive. No. Anyone can wear whatever they want. Very true. But that's what I'm expecting. Now you know who was throwing bottles at you. The dark spots on the floor were throwing the bottles. That's true. Thank you, beekeeper. I haven't found car keys either. Well, let me check that. I was hoping for, like, I don't know, pizza delivery number, maybe? I've not seen anything like a phone number. There we go. There's our human meat. The hand came down. Yeah, I saw a dark spot and I was like, it's going to be another bottle. But no, in fact, it bottle crack. Bottle crack. You got one human meat. So who are we going to take the outfit to? Um, Bush person or shower person? Uh, So let's... What's oh, a dress shirt? Oh, okay. A shirt... A loose shirt has some tip. I thought it was a dress. It looks like a dress. It did look like it looked quite long for a, a polo shirt, I guess. Uh, or a button up. Alright, so shower or um we're still mates. are we still missing a no we're not missing a part. No, we've got all three. Um We promised shower person first. That's true. Let's let's do that. A shower person. How many cups do I have now? Oh, I have six party cups. We can stack here, too. We'll do this first. Yes. I'm a little worried about what's going to happen with the noose. Same. Always. Dress shirt looks fine. Beans. Will do. And some shoes. Awesome. All right. I think that's all I need. Oh, by the way, probably should have gave you this to you sooner. 
Didn't even notice this was in here earlier. You got inflatable doll. Good. Way into item. Shit's been creeping me out. Hey, am I leaving so I can get changed? So I would like to point out in the in that room uh -huh. in the bathroom. You said the the hands on the on the mirror. Uh huh. But there is a butt print also just below the handprints. Oh, there sure is. Well, I called it right what was happening. You did. <laughs> they gotten changed yet? Aw. Have it on always dash, but it's not always dashing. So I guess dash has been disabled, oh. and that option hasn't been. Because they're both defaults. You dash when you're outside. Do I? I haven't even noticed. Yeah, you dash a little bit faster out right. there. Here we go. A CW for suicide stuff. Maybe. Very possible. Oh. Fuck oh, you. Handle. Okay. Fuck you. That's good. That's fucking good. I'm very glad that whole handle is the context. <laughs> you know that's fucking intentional. Is the sensitive context that we're being given here. Uh-huh. All right, that sounds like something opened to the left. Oh, probably the secret passage we were looking at, right? Uh-huh, almost certainly. Why does it... Uh, attic. Yeah. Two, three cups. An opened board game. It's missing some pieces. Let's play let's play with peeled labels. You got an empty bottle. Oh, okay. You got an empty That it? I guess. Surely it's gotta do more than that. Uh the Entity is right there. Oh, you are so right. Oh, he's... Is he getting brighter or anything? I don't think so. Hmm. Oh, we got more bottles. Now we know what field labels are for. Can we go to the right from up there? No, we cannot. Okay. Yeah, now I see the dashing. Just not in the halls that are filled with gunk. Yeah. That makes sense. That's that's sensible use of running. Do we have another place to stack things? No, it's only been the two so far. Oh, the inflatable goes in the pool. Yeah. Okay. The wrong way. It's Prince, the inflatable. The inflatable reindeer. In hell, that game was wild. It's unbelievable that game exists still. Uh, and that the uh, creator still gets mad at people for not liking it. I guess. The weird pickup. There are some parts of that game that I think are very funny. And then there's a part where they make the racist caricatures out of uh, fucking baboons. That is true. It's not, it's not a game to look up. No. The game is called Spud, which we... Hmm. Well, I guess he got out. The bushes are empty. Yeah, kind of figured. There is... There's uh, another... There is... Yep. Um. Should have saw this coming. Though so I guess he died. And he died. It's interesting that they don't seem to attack back. Yeah. Good. Mm. So there's no flow to the water, which means that the um, filtration system is fucked. Because uh. that is not spreading at all. No. Search the pockets. You got the car keys. The inflatable doll's butt is all that's showing. Yeah. Or tits, I guess. It's probably supposed to be tits. Oh, yeah, that makes sense. This uh, is very silly. This is very silly in primarily really good ways. Yeah. It's, it's certainly not as dark. Uh-huh. I mean, it is on the surface. Yeah. 
but it does not have the the levels that the next two games have. Oh, there is sucks. no response. Well, he got out too, I guess. Looks like he busted through the seat and then through the front window. Mm -hmm. That's how we had to get out here too. Look at this incredible harvest. Uh-huh. Oh, there's more cups. Can I go around? And the bag. What was in the bag? A uh, cigarette bought last time. Oh. Now, well, wow, that could have really sucked. That could have been just death right there uh -huh. not paying attention. You got bolt cutters. Oh, now we can, can get another door. door. I feel like we're advancing very quickly. I see, uh, this game was, like, you said that this game was probably going to be shorter. Uh-huh. This seems like a, it's going to be a lot shorter, like we might want to done this. Uh-huh. This is the biggest uh... room in the house, but there is a deep freeze that is bleeding and shaking. Yep. Turn off radio. Here's where it wants me to save, obviously, and there's another handle up there. Mm -hmm. The VCR is plugged in, but empty. The lid is sealed shut. Well, we can stack cups in the corner. Yeah. I kind of want to give this cigarette butt to the entity, though. Okay. Well, I don't need to clean up every splotch of dirt. Piece of dirt. That's a compulsion that I've tried to remove from my life. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we should check on the shower person, too. Oh, yeah. No bloody footprints. That's true. Shower is empty. All right, they got out. That's good. They got out without bleeding, too. Glad of it. Glad of it. Why is there a forest in this closet? The trembling vestige contains nicotine. What? I thought I had one. Not enough. Cigarette butts. What happened to the one that we just got? Uh, we got bolt cutters oh, out of Oh, right. The... We didn't right. actually get the cigarette butt. Yeah, I also got confused in there. Because the last time we opened one that looked just like that, it was a cigarette butt, so I had assumed that was going to be the pattern. Uh-huh. All right, well, let's go pull that lever. Yep, it's a lever. Yeah. If, if anyone asks us, it's a lever. Mm -hmm. It's a lever, right? What else could it be? Fucking, we were watching old watching. Mm -hmm. And there was a thing in one of the games they played that the game what? told us was a dog. Five, we are one cup short. All right, we gotta look around for another. I it's guess. probably somewhere and we just missed it. Yeah. So there's a tape in the camera upstairs. But we can't but we can't jam it open. Uh-huh. I am not gonna lie to you. Still kind of afraid of what that tape is going to look like. Uh-huh. Oh, it's the game's got a category on Twitch, so um it's their fault if it's uh something really raunchy. Not exactly <laughs> the issue I was Oh I know alluding to. <laughs> I'm just making lightning the mood jokes. Um, Is there another one in here we didn't get? Uh, doesn't look like it. Really doesn't, eh? Hey? Can we, we have step to... forward that way? Yeah, that's where the feet go, huh? We should uh, open this up. That. Okay, oh, that's, okay. That's, here pretty, it is. that's pretty good. Um, Fine posting. Fine posting. Crushed can there it is. Hey. Oh, I can't get in there. Oh, there we go. Sorry, sorry, bud. Just gotta slip right by you. Grab the ranch. Sort of passed by that. Just gotta just get in here and really you're you're blocking you're blocking the path to the the ranch. I really need you to move over there. There's a cigarette, but hey. Uh, 
And that's the, yeah, that's oh, the... Oh, good, it opens pet. from this side now. Yep. Uh, we could fight that person. I would sort of rather not if we don't have to. Okay. Let's see if I can go past him or anything. Nope. No. Well, I guess we're fighting him now. All right. All because I tried not to fight him. Oh, finally ran out of crushed cans. Human meat. Human meat. Okay, I could just leave apparently, but I'm too interested in what else is going on. Yeah. So that was the guy in the trunk. Probably. He died trying to leave. Or we just killed him just now. Yeah. That's a, what? What? At the bottom of the door. Oh. There's what happened there while we were gone? What? what? It doesn't look like there. anything's changed. Yeah, that's weird. All right, pull the lever. Okay, another opening sound. Not that. This time it came from the right speaker. Um. There isn't anything to the right. There's literally that's the furthest right thing in the game. There's like some weird. chocolate chips down at the bottom right of the screen. That's oh, in the other corner too. Oh, okay. There's always the possibility that your character is a sex worker who's shooting a group scene and that video needs needs that video to make rent. Very That's possible. True. This looks like I should be crawling into the fireplace. You've met with a horrible fate, haven't you? Dang, son. Dang, bud, you fucked this you all, fucked the way up. all the way up. Is <laughs> she willing to run in the kitchen? Uh, have we cleaned up enough stuff in the kitchen that it's safe? Possible. We did clean up, like, half of the kitchen. Um, can mm. we go upstairs into the... Uh... Into the attic. Oh, the other way. Yeah. yeah, and feed the board game the rest of our peeled labels. Yeah. And see if the entity there is pleased by that. Very good. And we can bring another one to the closet. Yes. All right, just another bottle. Mm -hmm. Again, helpful. Make sure you, you know, always have stuff. Mm -hmm. It's five hits to kill the zombies. I can only safely use two hits from my own meat. I like that it still says Ninja Turtles Nostalgia. I'm just leaving that. Yeah. It's more. always going to crave more, isn't it? Gonna get nothing from this. Uh, that's that's the joke, right? I really don't want that to be the joke. Ah, bolt oh, cutters. we can use the bolt cutters to open the tape. I have done this before. Oh. Use bolt cutters on a broken piece of electronics. Now we can bring this to the basement. Which looks suspiciously like Red's basement from that 70s show. Oh. Mm, yeah, a little bit. Unfinished floor, freezer in the corner. Yeah, but like shitty party basements sort of all look the same. That's true. And call toll free 546 blank 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 blank. Oh, oh. shit, I'm a zombie. Hmm. And the zombie? Zombie likes to wobble on this tape. Oh man. Oh man, it's a good thing we got a shot of this. We're, huh? in, we're in auto dash. Oh no, they're dead now. Oh no, the zombie got them. Oh no, there's people here too. 
Oh, they're dead. Oh, that one's dead too. So is this one. They're all dead. Can't get into the, the place. Oh man, more dead people. No one's even reacting to people being murdered. No. Is this what Party Hard is like? I've never actually played it. No, not remotely. No. It's a stealth game. This is starting to fuck with my eyes a bit. Oh, just gotta murder everyone. So apparently area code 546 is not a real area code. I figured. Um... I thought I'd look. Mm -hmm. Much appreciated information, nonetheless. Everyone is really drunk. It's easy to ignore a lot of things when you're drunk, unfortunately. Uh-huh. Now get in the fucking box. Don't forget, call blank blank blank. Blank blank nine. Blank 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 blank. So we've got five, four, six. Hang on. Something something nine. Yeah, I'm bringing up a notepad app. Okay. Next note. Also, the zombie's gonna have jumped out of the fucking freezer when we cancel it. Five, five, four, six. Blank blank nine. Blank 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 blank. Uh, X, X, 9. X, 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 X. Okay. Huh. We know that the one button is... Yo! Good. Also, the possibility that the zombie is symbolic and represents something you could normally see zipping from person to person. Very possible. Doing a big murder. I'm inside. I... Wow, it's spacious in here. Dang, real estate's gotten, gotten way nicer in this it's town. Good huh? freezer. Well, his head's been chopped open. Uh huh. But that looks like the zombie on the tape. Sure does. Can I eat his brain? A twisted corpse. A twisted corpse. It only works if I'm in a position to eat his brain. If from down here, can't check him. Over here, can't check him. Down by the footsies, can't check him. Gotta eat his brain. Better at saying TARDIS. You're right, it is bigger on the inside. <laughs> dun, 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 dun! You are asked to join the consumption. Dun, 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 dun! Oh, not enough crushing in. Throw a lot of bottles. Uh-huh. It will take three hours for authorities to arrive on the scene. Four hours for paramedics to reach the house. And two minutes until you are completely consumed. Nobody's home. A VC RPG by Oats. Huh. That was cute. Made an RPG maker MV. So there's so much other stuff. Huh. I can only think of one other place to go other than by changing who we give clothes to. Uh -huh. Um, we can um go out the front door and see how we go out the front driveway. Oh yeah, and see how that goes. Mm -hmm. And then there's whatever the phone number is. Yeah, we only got four digits out of ten. Just walk away. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Just walk away. Uh, not a Morton Joe. That's a different one. Mm -hmm. Not Carl Hungus either. That's from fucking Big Lebowski. Shut up. <laughs> from the original Mad Max, just walk away. We will spare your lives. Just mm -hmm. walk away. What is, what's that, dude? The Ayatollah of rock and roll. Uh, I, I don't remember. Okay. Thank you for playing. It's, it's Mad Max, so he's called, like... Big Wangers Incorporated or something. Mm hmm. Oh, oh. One of the digits in the last four is seven. Yep, working on it. But I don't know which one. Not the first or the last, it's one of the middle two. Uh, let's just make a new. 
Okay. Line and then put seven down here mm -hmm. so that we know it's in there, but we don't know where. Okay. No resume. I didn't save ever. What about options? And same options. Same options. Off. All right, we got the intro. This time we give the clothes to person in the bushes. Um, and also give all our cigarette butts to the guy instead of uh, using one in a fight. Yeah, so we're just going to speed run strats through this. As much as I can. Was the date at the front in the same format as the phone number? Oh, I don't know. Because it was, it also was blocked out, but then said 1970 blank. Uh-huh. Find out. I don't know what it means. No. I don't think so. But the 7 might be in the same space. Yeah. I don't think that's it. All right. All right, see you later, beekeeper. Thanks for coming. Have a good evening. I feel like the other clues have been a lot more specific than that. You're right. I'm still writing it down because of the brain that we have. Mm, it may be helpful. You know we're going to have to go in here later. Mm -hmm. No? And we're going to have to crunch the, the bottom most. Yeah. All right, I forgot what a fucking treasure trove this first place is. We don't even need to talk to them, I don't think. Probably not. When we get to the zombie in the... Um, so actually, we can have it go a different way too. Yeah. Also, this is a um. We got the the thing that got the car keys. Yeah. From having the inflatable that was in the shower. That's true. So if we give our clothes to the person in the hedge, we might not get the car keys, but we might get something else that's interesting in a different way. Yeah. So we'll see how that goes. Mm -hmm. The only Ayatollah of rock and roll that comes to mind immediately is always Chris Jericho. Chris Jericho is always going to be that. Yeah, that's true. He did take that directly from Mad Max. Uh, Here's your cigarette. Yeah. Or just hold on to them until you have, like. Yeah, I'll just keep holding them for all of them. Right. You got plus one empty bottle. Yeah. Let's see, we've got nine of these. Well. Oh. Got six crushed cans. It's not gonna be quite enough to take them out. We're gonna have to use our HP. That's fine on its own. This should take them out, though. Excellent. Human meat. You got a human to beat. It retreat. The number one is worn down. Five, four, six. Uh, something, something, nine. Something. Not enough spaces here. Oh, well, there isn't, is there? There's only eight. Huh. Weird. Very. I 
I guess we can. We gotta, the kitchen has a lot of, of uh, healing and weapons. That's true. And yeah, the um, the labels. Um, we go to the attic, and we can trade two of them for an empty bottle. Who filmed the zombie and then put the camera on the tripod? Who was phone? That's a great question. I think what it turns out is that we're actually playing that game that got Sega sued. Night Trap. Oh, okay, yes, Night Trap. Not Chiller. No, no, that wasn't Sega for sure. Uh-huh. <laughs> Ow. So rude. You thought you were going to avoid the Grom coming around, hey? Yep. I wasn't well. looking closely enough. How many cups do I have so far? Uh, yeah, probably need to get into the um, kitchen before we can. Mm -hmm. I think this was the kitchen. Kitchen's downstairs. Yeah. Now. This is um gonna be great for the YouTube. Ah, uh -huh. absolutely gonna like unless we say something masterfully funny. Probably just like zip straight to the bit where we figured out all the things. Uh huh. Which doesn't mean we're gonna sit on our laurels. We're gonna try and be funny. Oh yeah. But the thing is, we have just done all of this. Yeah. No, I want to go this way. There we go. I go around. Can't get there without stepping on this. At six. Yes. Is, all right. Which do we open first? Uh, I think still the uh the pool. Okay. Because there's more stuff to do there than the, um... We didn't even see what the, like, other thing opened. Mm hmm Really. That's true. Like, unless it opened a door in the, the consumption zone. Yeah, that's possible. I think this is the fight with the thing again, right? I believe that's the case. This guy only takes two hits, so he's not as big a deal as the zombies. You got another in the meat. Okay, so I think that's all three, so we can get all the clothes. Hooray, pants! Everyone loves pants! They are a terrific athlete. Clothing item. Why is Audrey 2 in this house anyway? Like, carnivorous plant that eats human meat. That's kind of weird, right? I mean, like, other... Everything else I can imagine like, uh, being... Like, carnivorous here. plants would eat human meat if we fed it to them, we just don't. That's true, I believe Venus flytraps will eat human meat. Like, for a lot of reasons, we just choose not to do that. Uh-huh. But, well, to get out to the pool, we need the... The car keys. The clippers. Or, no, we need the car keys that... We need the car keys that go into the shed that has the clippers in. Yes. So, if we give this to the, um, the hedge person, something might but go... That's the pool. He's at the pool. How do I get to the pool? Uh, up to the left and stack the cups underneath the window. Ah, gotcha. I have forgotten. Mm -hmm. The lack of an ability to visualize in my head make it hard for me to remember some of this stuff. Ah, rude. Yeah, 
so far this is pretty good. And you can tell it's early in their career. Yeah. All in all, pretty impressive for an early game in someone's career. Yeah, like, it's short, and it doesn't have... Quite as much to say. Yes, thank you. Uh, that is a great way to phrase the thing I was trying to think of. Mm -hmm. I'm kind of wearing nothing. Alright, so when we give them to him, we're going to see um, footsteps coming out of the shower. Oh, I suppose. This is a, that's a dress shirt, but whatever, I'll make it work. Great jeans. Shit, I'll be going commando in these. And shoes? I think these should fit me just fine. Yes, finally I can get out of here. Don't know how you found these, but I would have been screwed without you. I'm gonna need some room to change into these. Here, you mind holding on to this? Oh, okay. Okay. No questions asked. Do you wanna turn around or something? Guess let's check out the pool. Um. I like using the bottled beer specifically because we get the label for it too. Uh -huh. So we're getting extra weaponry out of it. Yep. We can turn uh, two previously full bottles into one full bottle. Mm -hmm. That's what recycling is. Absolutely. And now we got the car keys. Oh, I have not healed. <laughs> that was close. Yeah. through so much alcohol um, just to walk around the side of a pool. And we've got two cigarette butts now. What is that second? Oh, that's the yeah, that's the terrible CRT. Yeah, we don't want to mess with that. It's, uh, it's too much for me. All right. All right. So let's go see how badly we made um, our person's life uh -huh. happen. I'm gonna see some bloody footprints in a sec. If you get the same stuff out of it, mm -hmm. I don't understand why that's a choice. Oh, hey! That's why that's a choice. Hey there! Don't you love it when the game just answers your question? Wowzers! <laughs> Instantly! Um, hmm. At least you found a towel. Yeah! Hey! Linda. Hooray! You got an extra human meat. It human retreats. Mm-hmm. Maybe there was something else in the um in the shower. Oh. I'm getting pulled out lever. No, just the bloody footprints leading out, it looks like. Yeah, the shower is empty. Um, how many cigarette butts do we have? Two. Okay. What was the threshold? Four? I think we'd given him three, and he hadn't done anything, so yeah. Yeah. Let's pull this lever, and that opens the attic. Uh. Uh, so we have the car keys now, so we can go oh, right. through the car to the shed and get the bolt cutters if we want. Yes. That's to the left in the kitchen. What? Oh, right, it is. I was trying to go back to where we got the car keys. Um. All right. Weaponry and healing. It's occurring to me that maybe I should Gottle. use my help more often. Gottle of gear, rather than um, rather than using up all the weaponry. So it's a moot point, right? Because if you use your health instead, you're just going to use the beer 
to heal you rather Which then than gives us more well oh, right those. those are empties versus pulls yeah i'm thinking that me might be a good idea ow ow all right i remember that last time that caught me twice now mm -hmm. I didn't want to suggest it. I appreciate you, Bad Road. You're allowed to suggest things, though. Hold oh, the I can get out to the... If I use a cigarette butt to save, then um, I don't then get to use it... Oops, fuck. Oh, well, whatever. I don't then get to use it to give to the mysterious entity. Hey, Andy. Hi, Andy. Good to see you. Bolt Cutter is a staple of survival horror. You, uh, you miss the Ninja Turtles, though. They let you, um... They let you have access to the chainsaw, but it's out of gas. Mm-hmm. I think it's really interesting that these guys have set life and don't attack. Mm-hmm. The only way you'll die is if you run out of stuff. All in all, this game is uh, built in a very interesting way, which is something I definitely expect from Oats. Yeah, it's, it, it is that. And, you know, I I don't hate it. I just don't want you to have that one. Yeah, I picked it up last game. 100% sure, because it would have drove me crazy if I couldn't. Ugh. I did, just got home, excited to watch the VOD later. Oh, excellent. It was pretty fucking cool. Love a single major dis no, two major disappointments, but overall really excellent. There's another yep. cigarette butt. Mm -hmm. Now we've got the shortcut. Yep. You know, just like in Dark Souls, the game that invented shortcuts. Right, so we've got three cigarette butts, and I know there's one more, but I don't remember where it is often. Um, I think we have enough cups to pull both. No, we only have nine cups. Yeah, we have enough cups to pull the... I would pull the upstairs one. Okay. Because I think there are more cups upstairs in the attic. We definitely had enough cups to pull all three, or to stack in all three places last time. Yeah, yeah, so... Every time I unlocked a shortcut in Sonic Frontiers last night, I found myself automatically thinking, just like Dark Souls, the game that invented shortcuts. <laughs> I don't know why you can't just unstack the cups. Yeah. Obviously, we're not a great cup stacker. No. There's the other three cups. When Melody Cups was born, she was born. <laughs> Alright, now let's... Yeah, the entity isn't there at first. And he fades in. Fades in the more and more we get. The more labels we give him. Huh. Hmm, do we have any more bottled beer? Uh, no. no. We've used all of our bottles of beer. Now we can pull the other one. Pull the other one. I just kept thinking of all the times on Freeman's mind where he opens the door and saying, this is where I just was. <laughs> That's that one guy, right? Yeah. That's the guy who decided to use the Arsler repeatedly in a Sonic video. Oh. Yeah. Don't watch. I don't watch him anymore. Yeah. It seems so good up till that point. handle and it clicks yeah i don't know what it's clicking now i don't understand what this one did and it's out of the right TV. side is tv it? no it's just right that's where we put the tape when we have the tape yeah so we can oh hey oh. there it is 
How did I miss that? Uh, I also missed it, so... Huh. Oh, hey! That's our fourth one. Yep. Ba -na 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 -na. Okay. Um, let's see if uh, let's see if he reacts to four cigarettes. Just stopped watching him after he finished Freeman's Mind. Yeah, we watched enough. We watched Game Dungeon for a while, and then we stopped watching Game Dungeon. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's why it's never on anymore. It is. It is not worth watching someone who does that. It's not like it's something that someone might not know was a slur. It was hard R. Hard R at the beginning, not the end. The other hard R. Let's see. The trembling vestige craves nicotine. I don't mind if I nick a duel. Trembling vestige craves more. All right, let's just let's just fill the trembling vestige with nicotine. Nicotine is for nicotines. Hmm. That was an onion article, I think. Was it really? Yeah, I couldn't be surprised. So it was uh, from the Onion Century. The trembling vestige seeks a vacant vessel. You got trembling essence. All right, who do we give? Who do we do this? Maybe the zombie in the freezer? Oh, I think maybe? it'd be someone who was still alive. We had to have effectively gotten everyone killed um, who was available just to get these cigarettes, is the thing. Yeah. I don't think anyone else is left alive. Alright, um... So, let's go back to the pool and see if something happened there. Oh, that's a good idea. Also, I have enough labels again for another thing. I uh, think. no, you have one peeled label. You ah, need one more. Darn. And I would have it if it would let me pick it up in the fucking driveway. If it wasn't for those meddling kids. I don't know why that bottle glitched out. You want to go back to the driveway and, like, grab it? Yeah, see if it'll let me do it now. We can just go out the front door, right? Yeah. Don't have to take the whole loop. That's interesting that they have save points that are that fuck you over if you use them. It's kind of funny. Yeah. That's kind of from soft. Honestly. That's there we go. Alright, cool. Drink that bottle of beer. Uh, I'd rather you know, do something for it. Not really anything else to do though. Yeah. To clean up a bit. There we go. Alright. So yes. let's see if that's the threshold for the board game entity. Mm hmm. Uh, it was from the, like, Our Century book, the historical headlines. Ah. Uh -huh. One of them was from the, when Joe Camel, like, was 86. Uh -huh. And it's like, well, they can't do advertisements anymore, but they can make a show starring Joe Camel and the Nico teams. Oh, no. Yeah. A sufficient offering. All right. The uneasy vestige seeks a vacant vessel. Ooh. You got uneasy vessel. Ooh. -hoo -hoo. Now, where do we take these? What are we doing here? I don't belong here. That's a great question. I'm very interested into where these vestiges go. Uh-huh. Literally, there's not a place that we could have... We, we have not to have killed everyone. In order to be able to get that thing. Uh-huh. Well, I guess let's watch the video. Actually, I guess we wouldn't have had to kill the one in the driveway. That's true. But you have to kill him if you want to just walk out the front door. Yeah, unless you get cigarette butts from him. No, that's not it. All right, let's see how this goes. Um, CW for flickering lights. Uh, hang on, five, four, six. Let me make really sure I wrote that down correctly. Okay. 
Yeah, we still haven't figured out the phone number. Uh, yep, five, four, six. Or why the phone number is apparently only eight digits long. And let's see, is it possible to avoid killing everyone? I think it might be. Just put yourself in the garbage. Can we get up to that door? Because it's back, back today. Oh, no. Possible to get around that? No, no. I have to kill one of them. Yeah, it doesn't let you in. Tried it last time. To kill as few people as possible, then. Yeah, I think we were gonna lose one there no matter what. We're probably gonna Fuck. lose. Uh, oh, no, oh, there we go. Hmm. I wonder if we can go through the. Can we go outside? Nope. No, they won't. Let they don't want us to go in the kitchen out of there, yeah. I yeah. I one of these two. And this guy. I was kind of hoping it would just be a puzzle to figure out how to not kill people, but no. No, it's just like this. Yeah. I'm assuming that each person we bit is also a zombie somewhere. Don't forget, call nine. I think that the number is, yeah, about or put down the same format I was thinking. Um, five, it'll be X, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yep. Which means seven is the middle number at the end. I am changing that actively as I'm speaking. Excellent. So we are still missing three numbers. We could probably figure out what the last number is mm -hmm. because it's on, um, it's slightly unhidden from the side on both of those things we just saw. Is it? Yeah. The, the number actually extends out from the... Well, we can't see it again. Damn, oh, fuck. Ah, uh, shit. Well, um, let's see if we can use this as a vessel. A twisted course. Trembling or uneasy? Use the trembling or uneasy essences. Um, trembling was probably... I don't remember which one was the trembling was the cigarettes trembling was cigarettes on easy was board game okay the cigarettes one was more difficult to yeah. uh, get yes so let's do that one now sure if we have to do another run we'll do one easy okay oh, are we about to fight the trembling essence no an unfortunate vessel Caught in a bad time. In one of the darkest places in the universe. There is no future for you here. The trembling vestige offers you nicotine. Sure. I just die of lung I sure did just die of lung cancer. Oh good. Now we're the zombie. Oh, shit. <laughs> what the hell? All right. That's good. Uh-huh. <laughs> oh, we went out and got, um, popped. Yep. This must be nobody's home. Ah, double entendre. Ah. All right. That's run number two. Let's it's see if at post-credits we uh, get another number in there. It's 1059. Yeah. I think that we can... Uh, we're not working tomorrow, obviously, because it's Friday. Mm -hmm. So if you wanted to do one more very quick run to see what the um, uneasy vestige would do for us. Okay. Or indeed just walking away. Mm -hmm. I think that would be an interesting one to do. Yeah. Or we can save all these for next week, because that might fill a stream. Hmm. No, you're right. 
Thank you for playing. And because we've done the, um... Fuck, it showed a fucking number! Sorry, that's... Didn't mean to yell. I was holding down Zed. But... Are you okay? Yep. Okay. Damn it. <laughs> I so, missed the number. It's okay. That's what VODs are for. Yep. And since we're gonna do this next week, then I can go over the VODs and look at the numbers for this. Okay. Thank you all for coming. Um... Oh, fuck. Here's our support links. You should definitely check out the Patreon and the Etsy shop. <laughs> oh, shit. Um, you can support us monthly on the, uh, on that Patreon, and you can get cool stuff for it. Little VODs, or not VODs, little, little vlogs, and uh, there's a Lego video up there, and Alice is going to do some painting videos. Oh, damn. Oh, uh, this this is this is interesting. What's going on here? I like that a lot. Uh huh. Okay, and we got the Etsy shop where you can get custom made um, pronoun pins, which are super cool. I've designed and printed them, and uh, Alice paints them. Perhaps it's supposed to be ninety four tomorrow. Fuck, oh, really? Yeah, that's what my place has to be on a Saturday that it gets hotter. Yeah. Fortunately, uh, if I get a, if I'm gonna get a migraine from it, I have plenty of medicine. All right, schedule. Let's look at the schedule real quick. Oh, fuck. I'm just gonna do it on this computer today. Because that's easier. Yeah. All right, tomorrow, <laughs> Will is gonna be doing Brick a Brack during the day on Willemus 23. And then in the evening, Freya Dragon on Xenon Fiber is gonna be playing Alien Isolation. Sunday, we got uh, Wandering Beekeeper playing the Wandering Village, I believe. It's the last stream of that. I believe that is the case, yes. Okay, and then Monday, we got Stranger and Annie playing Super Mario Odyssey. Mm -hmm. And Andy, over on his channel, uh, Andy Monium, will be playing Sonic Frontiers. Well, it says it's only Sonic Frontier on here, so there's only one of them. Yeah, but it keeps uh, shifting. <laughs> Uh, Tuesday, we got Brick a Brack with Willemist on Willemist 23, and Annie playing Bioshock 2. On Wednesday, we got Sue continuing to play Lies of P, and Bad Road will be playing off on his channel, Bad Road. And Thursday, Alice is going to be continuing Crisis Core Final Fantasy 7 Reunion. And back over on Andy's channel, they'll be playing Sonic Frontiers again. That's Andy Monium. Mm -hmm. And then Friday, I guess we're going to do a couple more runs of this, which is pretty awesome. Yeah. So uh, well, join us then. Don't, don't uh, get it twisted. We're going to extract every bit of stuff that this game has for us. Mm -hmm. Just like we did the other two. Yeah, because uh, Oats makes really interesting games uh -huh. that are... It is fun to see all of the paths of... Uh-huh. All right, so then we got our YouTube channel. Go back and watch um, No Delivery and uh, Sorry We're Open. Those were both really excellent. They were. Strangers with me on uh, Sorry We're Open. Mm -hmm. All right, as well as with me now. Oh, oh no, I am oh. being eaten. Oh, wow, wow. <laughs> You're adorable. Mm -hmm. All right. Um, yeah, I guess that's it for now. Oh, and an update for those who were worried. The uh, tribal money did come through. We're not completely screwed. Yeah. We have, we can afford food now. Uh-huh. <laughs> all right. So thank all of you so much for coming. I was, I, I cannot get used to going to the outro. I did it. Oh, you did it for us. Yes. Okay, so it was already there. Yeah. I appreciate it. Thank mm -hmm. you, love. Mm-hmm. All right, and uh, that'll do it for now. We'll see you on Monday. Good night, everybody. Good night.